In this video, I'm going to show you how to stitch together a series of photos to do an all-in-one sequence shot like what you see here. We're going to start off by opening up the folder that contains the images we want to use. Um, I shot these with the Olympus E3 and the, the 7 to 14 millimeter wide angle lens just so that I could capture the entire sequence of events in one, one basic frame, I guess. Uh, this is best done with a tripod. You'll see in this tutorial that I did it handheld, so there's some shifting, but it's really not perceivable in the end product. Uh, here I'm just selecting the images that I want to use. I'm not taking everything out of that sequence because if if I selected everything, the person in the in the sequence would be so bunched together that it would look too cluttered. Um, so there you can see that's the the sequence of shots that I am going to use. And I opened them all up in Photoshop CS5. You could probably use any version of Photoshop as long as it's got layers and masking, and I'm sure that includes elements. The first shot in the sequence is going to be our base layer. Everything is going to be added on top of that. Um, this is the next shot in the sequence. I'm going to go to that one. I'm going to select all, copy it, and then we'll paste it on top of the original image, which is our background layer again. Um, I'll go back and reselect on the layers menu on the right hand side here um, the second shot and we'll go down to the quick mask button you'll see that down at the bottom of the screen being selected um, once we do that we're gonna select the brush tool and set the color to black and from here we're basically just going to start painting on top of this picture and it's gonna let the background image bleed through so we're masking this where we're painting out so that the background shows through. And the reason I set this layer is opacity so that you can see where the frame in the previous shot is at. And as I paint, you'll see the background image come through. Um, you want to take care not to paint over your current layer's main subject, you know, our bike rider. If you do, he basically is going to be erased and you won't see him in the finished product. So you just take care of doing that um, and again the you can see where where I moved during the capture of this uh, you'll see it when I started racing the trees and the basketball hoop on the left um, and you can see that I'm masking out the location of the first frame rider and again that's why I set the opacity of this layer so that you can actually see the rider in the first layer so you know where to erase if you did this using a tripod and you didn't have the shift that I've got, you know, which makes the background items appear blurry, then you wouldn't have to erase everything. You would just erase the layer where the layer below shows the rider. Um, it would save a lot of time. You know, the way I did this is kind of sloppy and it was spur of the moment and the idea had just struck me while I was there with the bike riders. All right, things are going to speed up here uh, just to save some time. We're basically going to repeat the steps that I showed before where we copy the next image and paste it over the original image to create a new layer. We mask and we just keep erasing. Um, and again, you know, it's just a matter of erasing around your subject on the current layer in order to allow the original layer to show through. It's really pretty easy, just a little time consuming. Um, yeah, and I recommend, again, using a tripod when you do this so that you don't have to spend so much time masking out background elements to eliminate that crazy blurring that I've got. And I also recommend using a Wacom graphics tablet just because it's a lot easier to do the, the fine detailed erasing if you've got a pen stylus in your hand. Uh, it speeds up the process quite a bit. Um, I hope to see some people's images using this technique pop up on the Get Olympus Facebook page. Um, you can do it with anything. So just remember, everybody, uh, get out there, get shooting, and get Olympus.